hello, how are you? I am back again. Today I thought I would do a quick video on how to use a shower oil. I have one here, it's brand new, but I have used about six bottles of this in my lifetime because I'm obsessed. I just keep going back for more. It's very rare that I don't have a bottle of this in my shower and I was about to put it in and then suddenly I was like, I'm gonna do a quick video. Anyway, this product is amazing. It's the L'Occitane Almond Shower Oil. It's amazing, it smells so good. It's so just like perfect and it's almondy and it kind of doesn't clash with your perfumes but it's just really luxurious and really delicious and kind of invigorating and like awakening but also really soothing and comforting. Like you can use it any time of the day and it just feels amazing and it leaves your skin super soft and subtle. So today I thought I would have a quick chat about it and also how to use it in three different ways. So first of all, this is an in shower product. So you get in the shower, you get wet, and then you start to use it. So first of all, you can just use it a little bit like you would use a shower gel. So you just get wet, put a little bit in your hand and like rub it all over your body and it will kind of like emulsify with water, lather up and it will kind of cleanse you in the way that like a cleansing balm on your face will cleanse your face, it will cleanse your body in kind of the same way. So it will kind of emulsify, it will lather up, and then you can just rub it all over yourself, which feels very nice by the way, and then rinse it off and that's you clean. Or you can wash with a shower gel, you can exfoliate, you can buff, you can scrub, you can do whatever you want, you can just get clean with soap or shower gel, and then you can use this kind of like a second step to kind of like give a little bit of a second cleanse, but also just put some moisture back into your shower. So like if you like an in-shower moisturizer, then this is kind of it. But unlike other in-shower moisturizers, you do rinse this one off. But it was kind of, it will kind of give you a second cleanse, but it will also leave your skin feeling a little bit more nourished and hydrated. Thirdly, you can just drop it into the bathtub. You can use it much like a bath soap. You can drop it in, it will turn milky, it will kind of mix with the water. It will just smell lovely, feel good. Also, if you do like to use bath salts, you can put the salts in, which are unscented. You can drizzle a little bit of this in. It will kind of turn everything a little bit milky, a little bit softer. Very good if you have hard water. And you'll get that beautiful scent as well. And you'll get a little bit of cleansing action as you soak. So that is three ways to use it. <laughs> and it's just a gorgeous product. It smells incredible. I love, 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 love everything about this product. It's about 19 pounds a bottle. 100% worth it, a little does go a long way. And, and also, if you are hooked on this product like I am, you can buy a refill bag, which is double the quantity of this, 500 mils in a very good, sustainable kind of plastic thing, like a plastic baggy thing. And you get 500 mils for, I think, 28 pounds, which does reduce the price a lot because this would normally be about 40 pounds for two of them but you can get a refill bottle, which is basically two of these for 28 pounds, which I think is a good price. Anyway, that is my video. I hope it's of help. That is how you use shower oils. You basically use it on their own. You can use it as a second cleanse or you can use it in the bathtub. And I am a big fan. I love a shower oil. They are a bit of a revelation, especially great if you have any kind of eczema or you have sensitivity or you have dryness or in the winter, you just don't want to moisturize your legs. You just want to like, have hydrated legs already. This is how you're gonna do it. Anyway, that's my video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope it's of help. I hope it answers your questions. And if you have any questions for me, please do drop them below. I will answer, I will chat. I don't have much to do with my time. I wanna chat to you, so do message me. Anyway, that's my video. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you like. I'll see you again soon. Bye. <laughs>